Heart disease is the leading cause of death globally, and many people don't realize that their food is the main culprit for this. In United States, 695,000 people died from heart diseases in 2021 alone. Heart diseases can't be cured fully or reversed. And many believe medical intervention is the only solution to relive those symptoms. However, on the brighter side, you can improve your heart health with a proper diet and a correct lifestyle. Knowing what to eliminate is also essential to keep your heart health in good condition. Let's look at foods that are most damaging to your heart and also at the healthier choice for better health. Number 1. Trans fats and saturated fats. High fat meals bring several changes to the red blood cells. First, they interfere with the functioning of the red blood cells, which is not healthy for the heart. In addition, it also lead to an increase in an enzyme called myeloperoxidase, MPO, that implicates atherosclerosis and heart attack. It leads to a loss of elasticity in the blood vessels and the oxidation of high-density lipoprotein cholesterol. High-fat foods are the primary reason for the blockage of blood vessels. Butter and cheese are full of saturated fats. As a result, they tend to raise cholesterol levels, especially low-density lipoprotein, bad cholesterol. Margarine is a healthier alternative to butter because it is plant fat. Next, sodium. Excessive sodium consumption can lead to high blood pressure, which is a significant risk factor for heart disease. Raised blood pressure is the dominant cause of death and disability in adults worldwide. It is responsible for approximately 50% of deaths from coronary heart disease and over 60% of those from a stroke. Evidence from various studies shows a consistent direct relationship between salt intake and blood pressure. A study suggests that a 4.4 grams reduction in daily dietary intake of salt decreases blood pressure by about 4.2, 2.1 mm Hg. Therefore, a moderate reduction salt intake is essential to prevent heart disease and control high blood pressure. Third, added sugars. Consuming too much added sugar can lead to weight gain obesity, and type 2 diabetes, all of which increase your risk of heart disease. Each sugary beverage you consume each day increases your chance of heart disease by 8%. Increased sugar levels can cause sodium to accumulate within a cell, leading to calcium buildup. It results in vasoconstriction and hypotension. At number 4. Processed meats. Processed meats like sausage and hot dogs are rich in saturated fats. In addition, their preparation involves high quantities of salt. This can result in hypercholesterolemia. Studies show that saturated fat accounts for more than half of the calories in bacon. It will elevate the bad cholesterol and increase the risk of cardiovascular attack or stroke. Now let's look at risk factors for heart disease. Diet is not the only cause of heart disease. Family history Genetic disorders such as poor heart structure or function of the heart muscles since birth. Age. As we age, the heart muscles get weaker and gets harder to pump blood effectively. Gender. After menopause, the risk increases in women due to hormonal change. Smoking. Smokers are at a higher risk of heart attacks than non-smokers. Alcohol. Alcohol disturbs the arteries and causes irregular heartbeats. Stress. Unresolved stress can harm your arteries and can also disturb the cholesterol levels in the body. Poor dental hygiene. When your mouth and teeth aren't healthy, germs can enter your bloodstream. They may go to your heart, leading to endocarditis. Diabetes. Diabetes can cause damage to the blood vessels. Obesity. Additional fat deposits can clog the arteries, increasing risk for stroke. Lack of physical activity. Poor physical activity can lead to fat accumulation, which can be a reason for fat buildup in the arteries. While certain risk factor is hard to prevent and not in our control, healthy diet and active lifestyle is the key to good strong heart. Other than diet, here are a few tips and tricks to reduce your risk of heart disease. Control your portion size. How much you eat is just as important as what you eat. Overloading your plate Taking seconds and eating until you feel stuffed can lead to eating more calories than you should. Eat more vegetables and fruits. Vegetables and fruits are good sources of vitamins and minerals. 
vegetables and fruits are also low in calories and rich in dietary fiber. Select whole grains. Whole grains are good sources of fiber and other nutrients that play a role in regulating blood pressure and heart health. You can increase the amount of whole grains in a heart-healthy diet by making simple substitutions for refined grain products. Limit unhealthy fats. Limiting how much saturated and trans fats you eat is an important step to reduce your blood cholesterol and lower your risk of coronary artery disease. Choose low-fat protein sources. Lean meat, poultry and fish, low-fat dairy products, and eggs are some of the best sources of protein. Choose lower-fat options, such as skinless chicken breasts rather than fried chicken patties and skim milk rather than whole milk. Limit or reduce salt. Eating too much salt can lead to high blood pressure, a risk factor for heart disease. Limiting salt, sodium, is an important part of a heart-healthy diet. Plan ahead your daily menus. When selecting foods for each meal and snack, emphasize vegetables, fruits and whole grains. Choose lean protein sources and healthy fats, and limit salty foods. But do allow yourself an occasional treat. Thank you for watching this video. Do like and subscribe to our channel. Good food, good life. Let's get healthy through food.